Science. Scientists in Australia have discovered a new method for determining whether coral is healthy or not, a breakthrough which could improve the outlook for many of the country's breathtaking reefs. There are many reasons why coral reefs around the world have begun to decline. Climate change, human activity, pollution and so on. But until now, observation was the only way for researchers to detect diseased coral. And that would take a year, a year in which the infections and diseases would carry on spreading. The new technology is called quantitative PCR and is used already in human medical research or forensics. Now it's being used by marine scientists to detect the presence of microbes such as bacteria, viruses and fungi that cause coral diseases, like white pox, which devastated reefs off the coast of Florida. Previously trying to diagnose disease has been very difficult because corals only display a few symptoms or signs that they're actually sick. So if we know what causes the disease, then we've got management options. Um, and we know we can look at what is transmitting the disease in terms of if it's humans or if it's actually something in the marine environment. Coral reefs may appear strong, but they're fragile ecosystems, primarily because they can only tolerate a narrow temperature range. Many reefs are already at their upper limits. When ocean temperatures get too high, coral turn white, bleached and generally die. It's thought that more than a quarter of the world's monitored reefs have died out over the past decades. And around a third of all coral species could be heading for extinction.